Alright guys, NMRC here with you guys. It's another uh, <clears throat> parts slash mail drop episode. I guess you can say scale mail, whatever. Um, I don't know what all exactly came in, so it's going to be a surprise for you and me. I think one thing I know came in that I haven't looked at, it's going to be awesome. Even though I don't have that truck in real life anymore. But uh, let's crack open this first box here. I would have that other light on, but it's so bright, man, with that other light. It's, it's, it's insane. So, wait. Let me turn on this other little light. Oh, wait. That other little light's gone. Let's see, how's this one? Oh, there we go. That one works better. Okay, you guys don't need to see that. Cause that's just shipping info. Okay. Um. What is that? Huh. I don't know what the heck that is. I'm gonna have to uh. Unbag it instead of unbox it. There's something there. Is that just that? Yeah. Okay. So that's just that. We can set this box down here out of the way. Let me, uh, I'll aim it at the truck so you guys ain't looking at tools while I get this out of the bag, hopefully here. Come on. Come on. Well, here we go, here we go. Unwrap it. Well, that looks like the the lenses. Okay, I think that's the lenses to what I was telling you guys. I think I know what came in. Oh nope, that's from uh, Shapeways. I got the MSD ignition system. Wow, I didn't know it was all clear. That's weird. Wonder why it's all clear. I gotta paint it red. Huh. Well, anyway. That's the, oh, come on, phone. MSD ignition, the 6AL box with the coil for this guy to put on the dash, or not the dash, on the firewall. Oh, sweet, that's cool. So that came in from Shapeways, my ignition system. Oh, yeah, that's what that is. Yeah, I don't know why they did it in clear. That's weird. Still got to paint it red either way. But, um... Anyway, that's that. Let's see what's in this box here, guys. I wonder if this is for the micro... Hang on. Got to pull it out. Ugh. Oh, dude. No way. Yep, that's for the micro right there. Got the ESC in that bad boy. So if you guys don't know, it's for this little micro right here. And uh, I got this motor mount <laughs> for this reason, for this guy, because we're going, we're going brushless on this bad boy. I'm sure you guys already seen tons of videos of people doing it or running them, but not building them. So other than the cat that I bought that motor mount from which is I want to say GYMRC this is YouTube channel and Shapeway uh, name to order from there but uh, heck yeah dude it's the Sidewinder Micro 2 and you're supposed to be able to do drag brake and everything on this little guy and it goes up to 3S the reason why I got this instead of the Mamba X series as do the fact of how small it is. This is a giant box for how, honestly, how tiny it is. So, um, I'll worry about unboxing that here in a minute. So, now we got two bags here. Let's pull this stuff out here. I'm trying to make sure I got it all. Oh, sweet, sweet, sweet. So, we got some hot racing items. For the uh, micro right here, this is the uh, body mount 
aluminum rear body mount support right there boom boom for that deadbolt i am telling you guys i'm, I'm gonna have the most hopped up scx24 i just couldn't find the hot racing shocks they make anymore but i'll have every piece of aluminum they make on that on that scx24 here and then now we got the adjustable well aluminum front and rear adjustable shock towers slash esc tray got that finally so that's awesome um oh we got another bag here Let's see what's in this bag here i hope it's other stuff but it probably isn't so i'm still waiting more stuff like that for the micro guys so you're gonna have to wait oh sweet got the one of the pinions for the micro to go brushless on this baby it's an 18 tooth or is it 18 no it should be smaller than that what size is this one i know i got a 12 and i think a eight or a nine tooth so i can get uh, more torque instead of a ton of wheel speed out of it so i just don't know why i didn't get both of them in this one package here but okay i'm still waiting for the other pinion because i bought two all right now we got this sweet bad boy from russell on facebook um i'm gonna have to look up and cut into this video of what his uh real name is it's scale something i can't remember exactly but he print 3d printed me this body so we got the grill right there which i have something in store for this oh he even has the lenses all right there for it okay oh man here we go here we go here we go or i'll put the name of his uh Dill in the description. Oh man, sweet. There's the hood. I can make it open like I wanted to. Oh dude, this is thick too. Look at that guys. Look at how dang thick that is. Watch, let me Wow. Of course I knew I was gonna have to sand it, you know what I mean? A little bit. There is a little bit of lines. See that? That ain't bad though. I mean that's pretty dang nice. A little bit of body work ain't hurt nobody. You know, how much damn body work I did on that thing there. This this ain't going to be nothing. So that that's the hood, the grill. I'm trying to get the front clip out here. Oh, wow. Check this out, man. If you guys can't figure out what this is supposed to be, you're going to find out here in a minute. Oh, my gosh. All this paper is everywhere. If you can't tell by that front clip, you shouldn't be a truck guy. I mean, look at this front clip compared to that one. It's definitely not a square body. You know what I mean? Definitely not a square body, guys. <clears throat> All right, let, let's see. Let's see. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. We got the back half, front half of the uh, step side. You guys should be able to guess what it is. Like I said, I don't have the real truck anymore. Here we go. Ooh, here's the cab. Woo -hoo -hoo. Look at that. If you can't guess what it is for sure with seeing the cab, and you ain't you ain't a true American and a muscle car guy, muscle truck guy. I'll give you guys a hint. It's a 1969. We even did the gas cap like the real truck right there. That is killer, man. This guy did some great work. I mean, look at that. That is beautiful, guys. Holy moly. Oh, don't drop it now. Okay. There should be another piece. The, other, the back end of the bed here. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, we've got a little bit of sanding to do in, but man, this looks sharp, man. 
These guys killed it on this body. Wow. Look at that, guys. Are you kidding me? Step side 69 C10, if you haven't figured it out by now. Used to have this truck in real life, but I sold it, went on to better things. I ain't got time for that. I really don't have time for this stuff either, but man, this guy posted up on uh, on Squareheads RC on Facebook. Go to Squareheads RC, join that group, man. It's all it's all square body. He posted square body stuff like this, and I hit him up. I said, hey, man. What about a bad boy like this? Can you print out me a body like this? And he said, sure thing, man. And he does more. He does more. He does different kinds of years. And, and suburbans and, and regular cabs, crew cabs, probably extra cabs. I mean, honestly, I think you name it, he can do it. You know, it's Russell. Um, just, you know, go to Skell. Uh, Squareheads RC on uh, Facebook. Join that group, man. It's an awesome group. Leo, uh, Ricky Leo, I think is his name. That's the admin. He makes awesome stuff too. He's a cool cat. He's the admin. But anyway, let's set this baby together and see what we got here. All right, guys. This is how it looks. It's just like a puzzle, man. It goes together perfectly, man. You just got to feel... The line that goes, you know, where it separates it. But you have to do that anyway if you glue it together. So, but see these tabs right there? That's amazing. That's what helps it lock it in and guide it into place. So I'm sure, I'm sure after you glue it together, you can like uh, sand these off with a Dremel or cut them off and then fill it, boom, sand it. Make it all smooth, you know what I mean? And then just keep the ones on the inside here in the fender wells. Shoot, you could probably do do that one off there too. But man, that this is good quality, man. This sucker is nice, dude. He did a dang good job. And I'll probably cut this tailgate off so it can move. I don't know, I think it's just in there, yeah. Well, we could cut it and have it come out so it's on a hinge system. Just like the RC four-wheel drive tailgate. Use those hinges. And then there's a cab. The fitment is, is killer, man. It's really good. The hood ain't going to sit on there perfectly because, you know, the, how the real truck is, you just got to gotta place it and glue it in and all that stuff. But, you know, it, other than that... Everything else locked right in. This to the cab. The bed together was was a breeze. But uh, I'm going to put hinges on there and make the hood open. And stuff like that with the magnet on here. Just like the RC four wheel drive body. The magnet on the hood and, and the radiator support. But this thing is just... It's beautiful, man. I love it. He did a hell of a job. And then you can build your own firewall. You know what I mean? That's no big deal. He left it like that because, you know, you don't know what model. What model, you're, you're, what chassis you're going to put it on. But I'm sure if you tell him in the measurements, he'll, uh, you know, he'll set it up, man, and make it accordingly. You know, those, those guys are good, man. He's good. I really appreciate that, man. This is awesome. But, uh. There you go, guys. That's what I got for now. When I get the rest of the stuff for that micro, I'll do a build and show you the ESC and all the other goodies I'm waiting for to come in. And you guys can see all those goodies. I still got to finish that bad boy up. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. You know, we got that, got that guy up there, which I think this body's going to go on to. So we'll see. We'll see. All right, thanks, guys, for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed. Um, appreciate all my new subscribers. Appreciate all the people that are still subscribed to me. Uh, 
you know, I know I've been slacking on videos, but I have priority, you know, got three kids. But uh, anyway, I'm still pumping this stuff out. This body, um, hopefully doesn't mind me saying the price, but this body was 140 shipped. That ain't bad, I don't think. That's a damn good deal. So, um, there you go, guys. There's there's an episode for you guys, and uh, hopefully I can get, get some more action, like crawling type videos um but yeah there you go guys thank you thank you for subscribing thank you for staying subscribed and uh, i'll catch you in the next build or possibly crawling action going on peace